Just to make things clear, I want to show you guys where I'll be playing for the simulator, and that's going to be the level 3 500 cost raid type Gion. Here's the main weapons, it's the Needle Missile level 1 and the level 2 Beam Saber. As for build, I have leg damage, a lot of melee damage, some health and thrusters. Now you can easily use this suit as well. I highly recommend the Gion if you're having trouble with it because it just does a lot of melee damage. And you can get this suit in the DP shop, which is the in-game currency shop. You just need to get the level 1, then the level 2, then you can buy the level 3. So I just want to say a few things first. First is this is my first time doing it under 3 minutes. That's what I'm going to do with all the simulators. It's not the best time I could have done. There's a lot of mistakes that's going to be made. Like my teammates constantly hitting me. And I am going to get countered one or two times. But I have to say, the Gion is an amazing suit to use for these simulators. And if you look at the top scores, or like the top rankings worldwide, you're going to notice that the best scores, everyone's using the Gion. And that's just because this suit is fast and has a ridiculously high melee output, especially its backswing. This thing hurts a lot and it will shred right through everything. So I highly recommend using this suit if you're having trouble. Also, this suit you can buy in the DP store, like I said in the beginning, so it's not like you don't have access to it. But just for a few things with the Battle Simulator, it's very similar to like the other Psycho Gundam, it's just the map is smaller, which is actually a good thing, so you don't have to move around and try to chase the suits and stuff. Also, I don't know if it's just me, or maybe I'm using the Gion, but I feel like the Psycho Gundam in this is a lot less aggressive. Like, throughout the entirety of this, I feel like he's not shooting me nearly as much as the other suits are. I think maybe that's his like other moves he has as well. You know, he shoots like continuous beams at you, he will send out funnels at you, and he will do a very long uh, beam saber swing, but all those moves are very slow and easy to dodge compared to like the previous Psycho Gundam, which did those finger lasers, which had like insane tracking. I honestly like this guy a lot more. And also he just generally looks cooler. But anyways, that's all I wanted to say. Another thing is, please look closely at the health because you're gonna see how much damage I'm doing to this guy. And like I said, I made a lot of mistakes and I was still able to do this under three minutes. It's a cakewalk if you guys know what you're doing. But anyways, Sloth Cakes here. Hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the video. I'm going to try to get the other battle simulators out as quick as possible for you guys. But if you guys done this with a different mobile suit, please leave it down in the comments. Tell me what mobile suit you used and what was your score. If you have any tips, if you have any tricks, or just some advice, leave that in the comments as well. But like usual, Sloth Cakes here. Hope you guys have a good one and see you next time.